I don't know. All right, YouTubers, back again. Spring's coming. I'm just gonna uh, show my mate in Liverpool. My new monkeys. I've got another pair. There's a big male there. Look. There's a little brother and sister. Twenty-one month old. Mum and dad are in bed. Just cleaned them out. Look. Somebody on YouTube asked me if I'd do a care video, but I can't because it takes too long. It takes me over six hours to clean them out. Just wiped all the patches down, all the walls down, clean sawdust, cleaned every window. It took me six hours. Um, I was up there, look. There's a little 21 month old boy, look. Hanging on the light like he's done since he was a baby. Alright, son. Um, so you can't see much because it's too late now, really, but. Um, I just thought I'd do this little video to catch up with you all. Now somebody said, with it being such a big building, how would you catch your monkeys? They're going across the tunnels. Uh, how would you catch your monkeys? So I'm going to show you how I catch them with no nets. Because I think it's barbaric when you go to buy a monkey off somebody and they catch it with a big net. And I don't like it, so... What we're going to do, this cubicle one, look all cleaned out. Oh, he's just being cleaned out. And that one's just being cleaned out. Oh, no one. There's one of the new ones. Little girl. Uh, I've got a wire floor in there. But what you do, look, we need to take the pins out. Little pins under there, look. You open the door. Lift that perch up there. The actual wire floor. Pulls out and then you put it back in like so. Makes it easy. Ah, there's one of my new ones as well, little boy. Right then, I'll show you how to catch a monkey or how I catch them anyway. Put these pins back in. I'll just pass the phone over to be honest. Let me just uh, put these pins back in. Hello. Put that pin in there, look. Now, let me get my stool. Right, monkey, as I know, monkeys love mealworms. Oh, what can I do? This is how I do it. This cage here, just a normal cage, what I've made. And I put two. Springs on the end. And I also made that there, look. Looks like an afro comb from the 80s. But all it is is a piece of window ledge. And I've cut it over jigsaw and it fits in there, look. And that's it. Right, I'll get my keys and I'll show you how I do it. Anybody can do this, just cut them all inside your cage. And you put this cage up there, look. Like so. Simple as. And you get your male worms. And your monkeys see them. What's these? Come on then. Come on then. Come on then. Where are you? And you get your comb. And a male worm. There she is, look on the wire. What's this? Come up here then. Come into the cage. Come into the cage. And you put that hook on there. And you stretch that one down there. And you lift that off there. And you've got your little monkey, look. And we baby. Yes. And you put it, when you want to put it back, you go like that, look. Put it back up there. You 
door like that. I've had full families in this cage. Come on, baby. Come on then, good girl. Okay, he wants to go in now. And you know your cage. Put that on the floor. And put your locks back on. Anybody can do it, any cage. Just cut a square hole, put a little door on it, and make a cage. And that's all it is. Cost you £2 to make it. That's all it is, look. If you want, you let the first female go in with a male, and if you want to separate them, if you want to separate them, what you do, you make another comb lock. So the both monkeys are in there, two monkeys. When the female goes over there and the male goes over there, you put that one in there, look. You've got male there, female there, and you can do what you want. You can swap them wherever, put them wherever you want. Lots of catch my monkeys anyway. Right then, I'm off. See you later. Bye.